Hello, how are you very good doing? Today I go Japan, stupid large Japan. It's almost like Chinese, but whatever. There's only a short one, so this will be nice and quick. If a man asks a woman to go on a date, she cannot refuse him. Hmm. Well, that's cool, you know. So if you're over in Japan, you see some cute little Japanese honey, you ask her out, she has to go with you. It's against the law for her to refuse. Let's see this next one. If an older brother asks to marry your girlfriend by law and honor you, Oh, wait a minute, let me reread that. If an older brother asks to marry your girlfriend, by law and honor, you and your girlfriend have to agree. So if your older brother wants your old lady, you gotta let him. That's just the way it is. It is illegal to cook fugu, or blowfish, for more than 80 seconds. Fugu contains deadly poison in the organs. Um, despite the risk, fugu dishes are considered a special special feast in Japan. So apparently if you cook them for more than 80 seconds, they'll kill you. And if I die from eating a bad blowfish, I'm coming after the prick that cooked it for 82 seconds. I'm telling you that right now. The importing of photographs showing male genitals is against the law. Thank Christ. Whew. I don't want to see some fucking little Japanese junk. I don't want to see that. I don't want to see that. Never. Thank God it's illegal. And last but not least, in Japan, women are legally obliged to wear bras in buildings with air conditioning. The reason? Men get too aroused looking at their hard nipples. <laughs> little Japanese guy's got a horny on too. Right on, right on. Hmm. So obviously Japanese ladies get beamed up. God damn, I like that. Only problem is they gotta wear a bra to hide that. So, god damn, I don't like that. Anyways, I hope you like Japan's stupid laws. They're kind of a short one. So uh, we'll get this one posted and uh, see where we go from there. Smooth out.